How to clean a very messy room. Tackling a very messy room can seem stressful and overwhelming at first. However, the sooner you get onto it, the better you will feel. Organize the clutter into separate piles and then work on neatly putting away each group of items. Thoroughly dust and vacuum the room once it's tidy to remove any dirt and to help it sparkle. To keep the room organized, try to clean up as you go about your day and spend a bit of time each night tidying before you go to sleep. Sorting clutter. Clean the room in small, manageable sections. It's easy to feel overwhelmed when you face cleaning a very messy room. Create sections or tasks that you feel you can complete reasonably within your time frame, such as focusing on a particular shelf, table, or corner. Make sure that you take a break between every task or section to help you stay motivated. If the room is very cluttered or if you don't have enough time, you can spread the tasks out over several days. For example, you could focus on clearing the floor first, then move on to the dresser, and then end with the bedside table. If the room is very cluttered or if you don't have enough time, you can spread the tasks out over several days. For example, you could focus on clearing the floor first, then move on to the dresser, and then end with the bedside table. Put all of the dirty laundry into the laundry hamper. Look around the room and remove all of the dirty laundry. Perhaps there are dirty clothes on the floor or the bed sheets need washing. If the laundry overflows from the hamper, get another basket or a bag to use as well. You don't need to sort the laundry at this point. Just focus on getting it all into the hamper. You don't need to sort the laundry at this point. Just focus on getting it all into the hamper. Dispose of all of the trash in the room. Simply removing all of the trash can make cleaning the room seem far less overwhelming. Place a bin next to you and get rid of any trash you can see. You can recycle what you find if it's possible, otherwise just throw the trash directly into the bin. If you are unsure about if you want to keep an item, keep it for the time being rather than wasting time deciding. You can always come back to it at a later point. If you are unsure about if you want to keep an item, keep it for the time being rather than wasting time deciding. You can always come back to it at a later point. Transfer all of the dishes to the kitchen sink. Unwashed dishes can really add to the clutter in a room. Pile up any used plates, bowls, cups, and cutlery that you can find and take them to the kitchen. Stack them neatly in the sink to wash after you finish cleaning the room. Getting rid of the dirty dishes will also help the room to smell clean and fresh. Getting rid of the dirty dishes will also help the room to smell clean and fresh. Create piles of similar items that belong in the room but aren't put away. As you work through the clutter, make small groups of items that need to be put away. Groups such as shoes, clean clothes, books, toys, paperwork, and electronics work well. You can also create smaller categories within each group, like if the books belong on the bookshelf or on the bedside table, or if the clean clothes go in the wardrobe or in the dresser. Don't worry about putting away the items yet, as you can work on that later. Don't worry about putting away the items yet, as you can work on that later. Place all miscellaneous items that don't belong in the room in a box. Get the biggest container or cardboard box that you can find and place it next to you as you work through the room. Put the items that don't belong in that room into the box to deal with later. These items might be things like bills, books, cosmetics, and magazines. You don't need to sort through every drawer and cupboard to try decide what to keep and what to throw away. Simply work on the things you can easily see and save going through any hidden clutter for a later stage. L greater than you don't need to sort through every drawer and cupboard to try decide what to keep and what to throw away. Simply work on the things you can easily see and save going through any hidden clutter for a later stage. 